skills are pretty useful in Castlevania Aria of Sorrow. For either getting better stats on the Headhunter Soul, or just for completing the enemy list. Unfortunately, grinding enemies for souls can be a slog. So, the Soul Eater Ring increasing the spawn rate of souls can be a huge help. The Soul Eater Ring can be a challenge to buy, being the most expensive item in the hammer shop by 286,000 gold. But with this method, the ring will become far easier to obtain. For this method, you'll need access to the arena, located here on the map. The frequency enemies will drop items and souls depends on your luck stat, so the first thing you'll need to get is the Gremlin Soul, which you can grind for either here, or here. The Ghost Dancer Soul also increases your luck stat to a lesser extent. Second, you'll need the Suchnoko Soul to lower the price down from 30,000 gold to just 24,000. Suchnoko Soul can be found in the room to the left of the big golem boss room in the dance hall. Third, you'll need to complete the puzzle to the right of the boss room with the beam skeletons. All you need to do in this room is press the direction on the D-pad that matches with the one shown on the wall, without falling off the platform. Here, you'll find the rare ring, which will increase the drop rate of rare items as well as a plus 5 luck boost. Next, take the elevator back up. If you need to heal or quickly restore your MP, you can go left, to the save room. Once you're ready, go to the right into the room of lubricants that leads to Auroch's suit. Now, go back and forth across the room killing lubricants and avoiding the statues for Muramasas. I use a levitang for this, as its fire is good for taking care of the killer mantle guarding the safe room, as well as not having too much cooldown, and having a high attack. You can find it here by taking this path. Another thing to keep in mind is that your luck stat increases as you level up, so this process can be sped up significantly depending on your level. Once you've gathered 9 more monsters, return to the hammer shop and sell them, netting you 243 gold, enough for the soul to earn. I hope this tutorial was helpful and that the corrupted footage wasn't too distracting.